Hey gamers, this is John, host of Video Games in the World, and today's news, I got a pair of things to share with you. First things first, does anyone remember the documentary Death of Superman Lives? Your answer is yes, right? Okay, for those who don't know about Superman Lives, it was written by Kevin Smith and was to be directed by Tim Burton, who you know for directing movies such as Batman, Batman Returns, Mars Attacks, Sleepy Hollow, Corpse Bride, Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children, and many more. So, according to an article of comic book resources, Warner Brothers once planned to make, to produce a script by Kevin Smith into an animated movie. Superman Lives was supposed to be a movie loosely based on the story of the death of Superman. Great story series, by the way. At New York Comic Con this year, CBR spoke to a room full of journalists and the co-writer of the Batman vs. Two-Face animated movie said he had once pitched an animated take on the canceled Tim Burton-directed Kevin Smith-written Superman Lives film in which Nicolas Cage was to be Superman. And Yelenek revealed the following. I had a big pitch and they took it seriously for a second to do Tim Burton Superman to do that animated. Nick Cage would do it, a reporter mused. He would absolutely do it, added Yelenik. Smith himself has expressed interest in an animated version of his scrap film, and he said, that would be really amazing to kind of see. Like, they turn it into a cartoon and get the people to do the voices. Nick Cage is still around and stuff, and I wanted Michael Rooker for my Lex Luthor sword, so that would be amazing. Um, but you know, I'm gay. He also went up to say that an adaptation would ultimately be up to the good folks at Warner Brothers and stuff. But if they were ever to call and say, hey, we want to do a cartoon version of that Superman script we wrote, believe me, I'd be like, that'll be dope, man. So yeah, he's been quite active with comic book based projects, directing episodes of The Flash and Supergirl. So an animated film could be a next step, which would be cool. Honestly, though, I think it would be interesting to see. But then again, who knows? Anyways, if you want to see the script, you'll find a link in the description. Now, to the update of, on the release date of the Final Fantasy VII Remake. At the moment, not much is known, but it's most likely to be released in 2018. The Final Fantasy VII Remake was first announced at E3 two years ago and the worldwide reaction was insane. So many veterans of Final Fantasy were so anxious to see a remake of the game come to light since watching a PS3 technical demo back in 2006. Wow. It, it really has been that long, to be honest. So later in 2015, we saw gameplay footage of the remake, which resembles to the Kingdom Hearts style of gameplay. Some fans didn't like it, others did. But the biggest insult to injury that disappointed the fan base is that the game was going to be episodic. Who knows if these three episodes might be like the three discs from the PS1. Or I don't know how many episodes they're going to do. Perhaps it might be that way, but perhaps not. It's been 20 long years since the game's release, and I still remember playing it, playing it nine years ago when I was 12 years old. Final Fantasy VII was my very first Final Fantasy game, and I still love the franchise ever since. So... Tetsuya Nomura, the director of the remake, has spoken about the upcoming PS4 title in an interview with Famitsu. He told the Japanese magazine that important details of the remake will be announced sometime soon, according to Setman Next. So, a possible announcement for the video game might be seen in the Paris Games Week of 2017, which starts on November 1st, three weeks from now. Nomura-san might have his opportunity to speak about it at the convention in Paris. So, maybe in 2018 the game might be released, or in 2019. Only time will tell, gamers. But if it comes out in 2018, let's celebrate for that, but probably it might be delayed to 2019. And as you know, Final Fantasy is 30 years old, and we had 30 years of magic, excitement, laughs, tears, and many more. So that is all, ladies and gentlemen. So if you people have something to say about Superman Lives and the Final Fantasy VII Remake, just comment, rate, subscribe, share, and support me on Patreon. This is John, host of Video Games in the World. Have a good one and play hard, gamers.
Bye-bye.